You could have told me Onyx had a trainer before introducing her to us. I think she wanted to build up to that herself, so I didn't want to make things awkward. Oh, yes. And me finding out when her trainer literally scooped her up in her arms in front of me was just pick berries and whipped cream. Fair enough. And then a human nearly catches Chalky because we were keeping an eye on him. It all just seems too much. I'm sorry, Mabel. You understand my feelings on humans, don't you? Absolutely. And believe me, on virtually every count, I agree. Especially when it comes to Chalky. It just feels like everyone has been telling me lately that humans are not so bad. And that I should trust them when I know for a fact what they are really like. It just makes me feel like I'm going crazy. I understand. And for the record, I don't think you're wrong. This is a Pokemon world, but unfortunately, it's run by humans. And good or bad, all of them want to use us for some reason or another. Hey, you're not wrong for taking the stance you have. Onyx's experiences don't equate to yours, so whilst you don't have to agree with each other, there is always the option to agree to disagree. You're really smart, but I like that you're also really sweet. I have my moments. I'm sorry things got awkward between you and Onyx. Well, at least we still have each other. I love you, Mabel. I love you too, Kane. Uh, Patrol. <laughs> uh, Patrol. I was thinking of calling myself Beatrizella. Huh? Maybe I can just be friend. Uh, Patrol. Maybe we should go with a whoop effect. I'm not a ditty! Uh, but... Huh? Is that... Oh, no. Dasher, don't do it! Fresh Beer Boy! Dasher, no! Yeah, I think it's partly to sweeten the deal with Clement. Show some extra community spirit and he goes the extra mile. Stop! To get us that desert Dasher, zoning, right? This is not the time to be eating. We're getting out of here right now. Oh, <laughs> 